What's good, y'all, man? We got huge Spider-Man news and Venom news, man. Venom 2 Studio reviews are great, and Venom 3 Spider-Man crossover. You know what I'm saying? I heard about Venom 3 is is in um, early stages, man, already. Because I told you, like, half the movies is already done. You know what I mean? They, they going to another another mm -hmm. stage, and that's part three. And same with Spider-Man 4. I heard about that shit coming soon. You know, they in the early stages. All these movies are done. They just waiting on... You know what I'm saying? It's waiting on when the, everybody will come back to the theaters and shit. That's what you know. That's what Sony waiting on and Marvels too. You know what I mean? Same way or anybody production waiting on. You know what I'm saying? But um, yeah. But half have, have, have the movies are pretty much done. You know what I'm saying? I heard reshoot, but they pretty much done. You know what I'm saying? They going to the next phase, and that's part three and Spider Man, Spider Man Four. You know what I mean? But, um, yeah, but let's see about this news, man. And, um, yeah, let me know what y'all think, man. Let me know. Um, like, so my channel, man. Um, yeah, let's get it. What's going on, everybody? It's Warren. Welcome back to the Cosmic Wonder, where we talk all things Marvel. And today we have some really, really cool Venom 2 Let There Be Carnage news, but also some news about Venom 3. It's looking like Venom 2 Let There Be Carnage is actually on the path to be a very successful film. Despite the release date, I mean, I've been on that. Everybody been on that. You know, it's all trailer. You know, what I'm saying? I've been it's gonna be a great ass movie. You just, you know, trying to wait to to come out and shit. So watch the whole motherfucking shit. <laughs> being delayed for three weeks. But if you think about it, it being delayed is actually kind of a good sign. That means they really want people to see this movie. That means they believe in the movie. They. Oh yeah, cause some always do. They'll be like, "Fuck it, we gonna drop this bitch." You know what I mean? It, it, it being some movies right now, just drop that hoe. You know what I mean? They know theaters ain't really open, but they said, "Fuck it, we gonna drop this bitch." Definitely you know, like they ain't a good movie. Like halftime, but it ain't a good movie. You know what I mean? Type shit. But if they really care about the movie, they gonna lay that bitch. And that's what Sony like, hey, this is a good ass movie. We are gonna, gonna lay this motherfucker, so y'all can watch. You know, the whole world can watch this shit. Cause it's, it's, it's this is a good ass movie. Just like Spider Man. You know what I'm saying? If Spider Man was a bad movie, they drive that bitch right now. No okay. cap. They say, okay, release today, trailer today. I right, released on, um, you know, September. You know what I mean? It, it, you know, they didn't really care about they, they movies like that. You know what I mean? Just, <laughs> yeah, no okay. cap. They actually do think it's going to be pretty good, and they just want as many people as they can to see it. And yeah. Tom Hardy himself, as I'll talk about in today's video, is very pleased with Venom 2 and is already planning Venom 3, and he wants yeah, Spider-Man to be in the film. Tom Holland yes, I'm Holland Spider-Man specifically. And today I'll go over wait, everything wait, 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 for man to be in the film. Tom Holland Spider-Man specifically. Oh, and today yeah, I'll go yeah, over yeah. everything that Tom Hardy specifically has said about Venom 3. And if you're new, be sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on any of the latest Venom, Spider-Man, and Marvel. So Venom so Venom probably gonna be a villain on the on the part three, um, you know Venom three. I bet he is though because right now he like the anti-villain. He you know he you know he a hero in their world. You know what I mean type of shit. But when Spider-Man come along, he gonna be a villain of Venom. So yeah, no cap. Marvel news. So Tom Hardy has already begun to work on around. Venom three. We see Venom how. two has obviously been done for some time now, and it's ready. Yeah, that's what I was saying. Like they they done with that shit. You know they just waiting for everything. To to calm down, you know what I mean? Let everybody go back to the movie theaters, no okay. cap. Ready to be released in theaters. And uh, according to Tom Hardy, what he said in an interview with Esquire magazine, it's actually pretty dang good, and he's pretty pleased with it. He also revealed that he wrote a fair amount of the story. In fact, in Venom, Let There Be Carnage, he is even going to get story by credits alongside screenwriter Kelly Marcel. So he was very, very involved with this story, and it looks like he wants to be even more involved with Venom 3. In the interview, he said, I'm thinking about the third movie as well, because I think you need to write that at the same time. A third won't be greenlit until the second is successful, but the studio was really, really pleased with number two. So first thing uh, to acknowledge. That's what's up. I like, I like that. I like that. whole studio was like, okay, this, this is going to be a great ass movie. I like that shit. No cap. I like here. That. Venom 2, Let There Be Carnage, obviously isn't going to suck. If Tom Hardy himself I mean, is so satisfied with it that he wants though. to write a third movie and the might, studio might, is really, really pleased but with me, it, yeah, it clearly not. isn't a disaster. It's actually yeah. going to be probably pretty good. And based off of the teaser that we saw and the trailer that we saw, it does look pretty good. I think yeah, Carnage I himself said, looks though. very, very good. I said, when you saw the first trailer, air, like, you could tell it's going to be good because Everybody went crazy. Like on the first trailer, when, when they said it's gonna drop Monday, or I think Monday, or, 
think, yeah, I think Monday morning, everybody went crazy. Even I went crazy. Y'all saw the trailer. It, the, the, you know, the first, first trailer. I went crazy. I was so excited. I don't know what the fuck I was saying, though. You know what I mean? Half the time. But it was like, it was, you know what I'm saying? You could tell when people go crazy, it's a, it's a good ass movie. You know what I mean? Like, come on now. Like, it's, it's, no, it's no, you know, no brainer. You know what I mean? No cap. Like, that shit, everybody went stupid on that motherfucker. Very good. I don't think and he's toned down too, at all. I think it's yeah. serious, but provides also a lot of comedy. And I think that Tom Hardy and Woody Harrelson are going to do great together on screen. And Tom Hardy definitely said more that we'll get into, but my takeaway from this is that Venom 2 is going to be good, and they're going to do a third Venom film. But then, of course, Esquire magazine had to ask about the possibilities of Tom Holland's Spider-Man showing up in the third Venom film. And based off of what Tom Hardy said, that's actually what he's going for. Here's what Tom Hardy had to say. I would be remiss if I wasn't trying to steer any kind of connectivity. I wouldn't be doing the job if I wasn't awake and open to any opportunity or eventuality or be excited by that. Obviously, that's a large canyon to leap, to be bridged by one person alone, and it would take a much higher level of diplomacy and intelligence. Sitting down and talking to take on an arena such as that, should both sides be willing and it be beneficial to both sides, I don't see why it couldn't be. I hope mm. and strongly, with both hands, push eagerly towards that potential and would do anything to make that happen within what's right in business but it would be foolish not to head towards Olympic games if you were running 100 meters, so yeah, I want to play on that field. So I think that's pretty much as straightforward that Tom Hardy can get. He says that he is eagerly pushing with both yeah, hands towards the direction yeah. of Spider-Man and Venom coming face to face in Venom 3. He refers to that crossover as the Olympic Games and he would be foolish not to go for it. These are his own words. He even says that he would do anything to make it happen. So as far as what is on Tom Hardy's mind in terms of Venom 3, well, Spider-Man is on his mind, specifically Tom Holland's Spider-Man. Tom Hardy wants Spider-Man in Venom 3 and he says he's going to do anything that he can to make that happen. This makes me wonder if Carnage is going to die at the end of Venom 2. Obviously, Venom. He probably is going to die. We know that we know the end, but we don't know the end. But we kind of like know he gonna. You know what I'm saying? Like he gonna die. But let's see. I mean, it, but it's gonna take some time, like to kill his ass, of course. But. Uh, he, you know, he might die. He Venom might 3 die. has not been written yet, but it sure would be really, really cool if we had a Spider-Man and Venom versus Carnage moment. And I guess I should say that we technically don't know that Tom Holland isn't going to be in Venom 2. But for right now, since we've had no type of confirmation for that at all, I'm not, not going though. to count on that. Do I hope? Nah, you're probably not, but... Uh... Yes, but I actually really don't think he's going to be in the film. But hopefully, yeah. Venom 3 goes the way Tom Hardy wants it to go. Because if it does, then we will finally have a Spider-Man versus Venom film. And it probably is going to be pretty dang epic. So... Nah, that shit gonna blow the whole world, bro. Venom and Spider-Man. Let's see. We are looking for it. Okay. Good news for Venom fans and good news for Spidey fans. It looks like Venom 2 is actually going to be pretty dang good, which I expected. And the yeah. hopes and most importantly, the too. potential and actuality that Spider-Man could end up in Venom 3 is very, very real and strong. Tom Hardy is going to do everything and anything that he can, like he said, to make it happen. And I think the studios could probably agree that it would be a pretty beneficial move to have a Spider-Man in Venom film so hopefully they agree and Tom Hardy makes it happen but be sure to let me know your thoughts on this in the comments down below would you like to see a Venom vs Spidey movie I don't know why I'm asking I'm sure everybody would love that so instead yeah I was it I don't want you but we gonna love it. It, it, it's like saying King Kong and guys up Spider-Man and Venom, you know what I mean? People gonna love that shit, no okay. cap. Just let me know what you would want <laughs> from it. Shit, don't forget man. to like the video and subscribe so you don't miss out on any of the latest Venom or Spidey news. For live updates, you can always follow me on Instagram and Twitter. And as always, thank you all so much for watching. Woof woof. Nah, we gonna like that. That's, that shit gonna blow the whole world, but that shit gonna get billion views. <laughs> no cap. But oh uh, nah, that'd be nice if they do that shit. Though. So hey, y'all go ahead and add Tom Holland, man. Well, y'all got him on, on social media. Y'all go ahead and add Tom Holland, man, and say, come to this motherfucking Venom movie and shit, part three. Hey, <laughs> you feel me? Come to this motherfucking Venom three. You know what I'm saying? It's like, I got Tom Holland on social media. It could be Twitter, Instagram, TikTok, whatever that shit is, folk. Y'all go ahead and add, you know, ass his ass. Go to Venom three, man. No cat.
But anyway, man, if you like some of my channel, man, let me know what y'all think in the comment down below. And um, yeah, I'm out, y'all. All right, peace.